On today's video I'll be recommending 10 dramas and movies starring Kim Nam Gil. Do make sure to subscribe for more movies and drama recommendations. Kim Nam Gil is a veteran actor considered to be the favorite of many Korean celebrities. With more than three decades of acting experience under his belt, the 42-year-old actor has starred in numerous critically acclaimed and popular films and dramas over the years. The following are his best works. 1. The Fiery Priest The Fiery Priest was the highest-rated miniseries drama that aired in 2019. It is an action comedy revolving around a priest with anger management issues. Starring Kim Nam Gil and Lee Harney. Kim Ha Illinois is an ex-NICE agent who became a Catholic priest. He makes spiteful remarks and he can be rude to others. Following the mysterious death of an elderly priest, he attempts to bring the culprits involved under the law. The hilarious journey in taking down the gangsters and corrupt officials in the city is what follows. Park Kyung Sun is a corrupt prosecutor who is known for being smart and very ambitious. They team up and work together to solve the murder case involving a senior Catholic priest. 2. Island Adapted from a webtoon, the currently airing action fantasy is set on Jeju Island, where three people fight against evil that is trying to destroy the world. Van as played by Namgil was raised as a weapon to protect the world against evil. Even though he doesn't show emotions while killing his possessed victims, within his mind, he feels great guilt. Lee Dae he takes on the role of one M.I. Ho, the only daughter of her father who gets banished to Jeju Island, where she now works as a teacher. Unbeknownst to her, the island is where evil roams free. She also meets other individuals on the island and together, the characters join forces to live. 3. The Pirates The Pirates is an adventure and action comedy that aired in 2014 revolving around a band of pirates and a group of bandits adventure in the sea as the hunt down a whale. Set during the beginning of the Joseon dynasty period, the envoy sent from China lose the emperor's royal seal to a giant whale. Jang Sajong who used to be a general before his betrayal now leads a group of bandits and he attempts to retrieve the seal, in order to get the reward. Meanwhile Seo Yoji plays the role of Yeo Wool, a strong and revered female captain of pirates, she grew up on the seas and overthrew the previous captain to save her crew. An interesting adventure unfolds as the pirates and the bandits clash in order to hunt down the whale for the reward. 4. Live Up To Your Name Live Up To Your Name is a very funny fantasy and romantic comedy that involves time travel. Kim Namgil plays the role of a genius Joseon doctor, who specializes in acupuncture. He worked at the clinic for the poor during daytime and earned a fortune by making secret visits to nobles and high-ranking officials' houses at night. Things go completely wrong for him, when his treatment led to the king's death. While on the run, he was eventually cornered into a river and fatally shot by arrows and fell to his supposed death. Shockingly, he awakened in modern Korea, and realizes he has somehow time-traveled. Dazed, lost and confused, he runs into a beautiful cardiothoracic fellow surgeon at Shinhe Hospital and began an unlikely relationship that transcends time and space. 5. Pandora Pandora is a nuclear disaster film that aired in 2016. A nuclear power plant is built in a peaceful small town in South Korea. All residents praise the nuclear power station for bringing new jobs and life to the quiet town except Jay Huk who lost his father and a brother due to coolant exposure and accident while working on the nuclear power plant. But now, he is forced to work in the station against his will. The nuclear power plant gradually corrodes, and one day, with an unexpected earthquake, old pipes in the nuclear power plant break and hydrogen gas explode. To stop the atomic explosion, Jay Huk goes into the nuclear power plant to save his beloved people. Will he save the ones he loves from the disaster? Will he come back alive? 6. Memoir of a Murderer Memoir of a Murderer is a 2017 psychological thriller revolving around a former serial killer who is losing his memories. The former serial killer Byung Se gets diagnosed with Alzheimer's. The doctor tells him that it's due to the after-effects from a traffic accident 17 years ago, the same accident that stopped him from his killings and allowed him to live a normal life with his dear daughter. 
So when a series of murders occur near his town, Young Se gets worried whether the killings are his doing during his memory lapses. But then he comes across Taiju and instinctively realizes that he is the serial killer. He reports this to the police, only to learn that Taiju is one. Young Se tries to find firm evidence that Taiju is a psychopath, but only raises Taiju's interest in him and his daughter. And now with his memory slipping, Young Se must find a way to protect his daughter from Taiju. 7. The Odd Family, Zombie on Sale The Odd Family is a supernatural zombie film that revolves around the Park family whose lives get disrupted after their elderly father gets bitten by a zombie. An Odd Family lives out in a countryside town. In this peaceful, calm town, a zombie suddenly appeared. Manduk, the head of the household, came across the zombie and took him into his family. This zombie was unlike any other, it had a handsome appearance, understood human behavior, and could empathize with people. Manduk's family decided to name him, and they took care of him as a pet. Later, they found out that once you are bit by zombie, you become healthy and immortal. They decide to turn this into a business opportunity, and put the zombie on sale. 8. Shark Shark is a romance and revenge melodrama that aired in 2013. After being left for dead and witnessing the death of his father, Hanusa returns to Korea from Japan after changing his looks and identity, to take revenge on the people who caused his family's downfall. While using Hawu, the granddaughter of the main mastermind, who was his first love when they were young, he finds himself falling in love with her again. Meanwhile, Jun Young is the man that Hawu got married to, while thinking that Yisa had died. He becomes suspicious of his real identity and motives. Will Han Yisa be able to avenge the death of his father and expose the dirty secrets of his enemies? 9. Through the Darkness The 2022 crime thriller is based on the 2018 non-fiction book of the same title co-written by Korea's first criminal profiler, highlighting his field experiences. It is mainly about a criminal profiler who struggles to determine the behavioral patterns of serial killers. Kim Namgil takes on the role of a criminal profiler, who is calm and has charisma. He digs up cases and looks deeply into the human mind. It will be another kind of drama that will give you a sense of immersion and tension that you've never experienced before. 10. The Closet The Closet is a 2020 horror thriller. Architect Sang Won, who lost his wife in a sudden accident, and his daughter, Yi Na, moved to a new house to restore their estranged relationship. Sang Won tries to get closer to Yi Na, but their relationship hardly recovers. Then one day, Yi Na becomes cheerful again saying that she got a new friend. However, strange noises start coming from Yi Na's closet, and she starts acting abnormally. And not long after that, even Sang Won begins to have strange dreams, and his daughter then suddenly disappears. While looking for Yi Na, Sang Won gets a call from a mysterious man named Kyung Hoon, who tells him that Yi Na is not the first one to disappear and that he has been looking for 32 other missing children for the last 10 years. Sang Won and Kyung Hoon then join forces to find Yi Na and solve the mystery of the missing children. Thank you guys for watching. Do make sure to hit the subscribe button to follow for more movies and drama recommendations.